pressing him through the fog. Without weakening in his faith, he faced the fact that his body was uh, as good as dead since he was about a hundred years old and that Sarah's womb was also dead. Yet he did not waver through unbelief regarding the promise of God but was strengthened in his faith and gave glory to God being fully uh, uh, persuaded that God had power to do what he had promised. Eternal Lord, beloved Jesus, I believe in you by the truth of your word and the power of the Spirit in me. I will not waver in faith in you. Fill my heart with thoughts of you today, even when I can I can see I will not wait to praise to praise you. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. The power behind his promise to you. Yet he did not waver uh, through unbelief regarding the promise of God, but was strengthened in his faith and gave glory to God, uh, being fully uh, persuaded that um, God had power to do what he had promised. Dear God, Heavenly Father God, fill my heart and mind with the incredible promises of scripture. Tell me the truth. Reveal false expectations and give me a belief that is convinced of the pure life-giving promises you have made. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Replacing the next lie, now, t now Tom's, as known as Didymus, one of the twelve, was not with the disciples when Jesus came. The other disciples told him, "We have seen the Lord," but he said to them, "Unless I see the nail." marks in his hand and put my finger where the nails were and put my hand into his side. I will not believe I weak. a week later he, Jesus said to Thomas, put your finger here. See my hands. Reach out your hand and put it into my side. Stop doubting that and believe. Thomas said to him, My Lord, my God. Then Jesus told him, Because you have seen me, you have believed blessed. Uh, you have believed blessed, and those who have not seen and yet have believed. Heavenly Father God, I want to call you my Lord and live with you as my God, just like uh, Thomas proclaimed, thank you for understanding my doubt as I continually reject lies and replace them with your truth. Show me the next lie that you, you want to replace. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Getting in God's uh, wheelbarrow. My beloved Jesus, Lord, my Lord, I believe. To a certain extent, to at least, I at least believe that a great adventure ad uh, awaits me if the little bit of faith that I have in you, I give to you. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. When your road darkens, Lord, beloved Jesus, I do believe. Help my unbelief. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Your belief and God. Lord, I do believe. Help my unbelief. Amen. The simple believe anything but the prudent. Give through, uh, uh, give thought to their steps. 
given it, Father God, open my heart, mind, and soul to your word as we learn more about who you are. I already believe in you, but I want to believe I in you, but I want to believe in you. Reveal yourself to me so I can live in you, in new, truthful ways. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Three big questions you must answer. Moses said to the Lord, You have been telling me, telling me, lead these people, but you have not let me know whom you will send with me. If you are pleased with me, teach me your way so I may know you and continue to find favor with you. Teach me your ways so that I may know you. It's a hum humble but de a desperate request, isn't it? We must know about him so that we can know him, so that we can, we can then make him known. What we believe about God is the most important thing about us. Heavenly Father God, I know some about you, but I want it to go further than that. Help me to know you more so I can love you more and in turn make you known to those around me. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. <laughs>